Hey y'all, I'm back. It is third week of hot August, or yesterday I saw the news call it October, because all the fall and Halloween direction, uh, decorations are in the stores already. We call it August around here. It's still summer, still hot. Today we shouldn't hit 100 degrees, but I need to take care of the rest of this over here because Pops and I are fixing to start working on the fireplace corner and I need to clean this out. I can't move the futon or move the table by myself, but I can at least get it all cleaned out. I just got little doggy. I'm watching her for a couple days and uh, just gonna kind of tinker. I'm not picking up anything heavy. I am feeling way better. Uh, very small pain still in the rib cage. Feeling way better, but I'm also not gonna overdo it by carrying and lifting a whole bunch of things. So, I gotta finish the rest of the summer of people corner and clean that up so we can start working on fireplace world. Cause it might be late August, but we're gonna be using that fireplace maybe next week. Cause a uh, cold front is coming. It's not even gonna be 70 degrees one morning. So that means heater for me. So let me get to work. to get the fireplace all finished up over there, at least that little section and the section behind the table. So when it's time, we can just light up the fireplace, smoke it all up in here from fireplace smoke. Looking forward to the fall for that very reason. Got our futon this year. Gonna have a little cozy place by the fire. Or maybe I'll just light a fire while Pops is out here working and turn off the air conditioners, save some moolah. Anyway, I think that's it. I have to box up some of the packages that you saw me move things off the table for and get them to the post office or UPS. That's it for now. I'm not going to show you those because they're packages and personal belongings and addresses. So it's almost Pop's lunchtime. I'm going to go in, have lunch with him, wash the dust and gunk off of me. See y'all next time. Hey, good afternoon, y'all. Here we go again. It's another great day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. You should be too. We made it to the weekend again, y'all. We made it. It's Friday. Nana and I both went and did our doctor stuff. Nana with her physical therapy. I went to the Cairo, went to Walmart. Made the rounds this morning, so this afternoon we're gonna do some work. How much work we get done, as usual, who knows. And our Project ADD has brought us back around to work on these walls. These walls, we're gonna work on finishing out at least the bottom part, and it's gonna be metal siding. We'll bring it in, all this stuff, get it cut. Metal siding is gonna go and it's gonna continue along the bottom right there. And then same way on this wall over here, which we'll get to after we finish this wall. So I wanna get that done. I wanna get the switch plate put in here on this switch, get the switches done and I'm not sure if we're gonna work up there or not. We'll see. We bought stuff to do that, as you guys saw, the panels that we bought for that. But I'm not sure when we're gonna do that. At some point in time, we'll do that. I just don't know when, because I'm gonna have to get the scaffold over here, set up the scaffold, yada, 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 blah, 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 all that jazz. So, we're gonna get to work on this right now. So you guys keep watching, let's get to work. Okay, y'all, there you go. I think that's it for today. Uh, we gotta go get cooled off, cleaned up, whatever you wanna call it. Gonna go have dinner with some family. I think it looks pretty good down there. I wish that the cross piece was a little darker, but we might, we might do some uh, vinegar on it. I don't know, we'll see how we're gonna deal with all that. Painted this switch plate, got the switch in, painted it silver because the other side is, really it's a brushed nickel, but that's the closest color I could come to it because the other one is a manufacturer color. So, 
Got that painted. I think it looks a little better than the, the gray plate with the white switches. And that's just gonna have to dry out. I think it looks pretty good. Got a little bit accomplished, didn't do too much, but you guys saw we brought in a bunch of bunch of our wood and stuff. We got all of our old fence plank plankings, our old fence planks and stuff brought in because like I said, tomorrow, maybe tomorrow we'll see how it works out. Tomorrow we're probably gonna do that wall over there. Get that wall done at the bottom and then we'll worry about doing the stuff at the top, I think. Yeah, that's the plan. I think that's the plan. So that's it for today, y'all. Appreciate you guys watching. See you tomorrow. Hey, good morning, y'all. Here we go again. It's another great day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in. Should be too. We're getting back at it this morning, y'all. So today we're going to move all this stuff out of the way over here. Pull that away. And then we're going to finish like we did down here. Finish the floor or the wall down to the floor. Then I went to get some vinegar because there are some little touch up areas that we need to kind of make darker and more weathered. So we're gonna put some vinegar and still wool together to put that on there. So we're gonna do that. Take that tape off over there and yeah. So that's the plan today is working on this side of the wall over here. So appreciate you guys watching. Let's get back to work. Okay, y'all, there you go. Got it. Got that done with the exception of a little bitty bit behind the door over there. A little bitty bit behind the door, gotta get that done. But I think that's pretty much it for today, y'all. Yeah, that turned out to be a little more of a bear than anticipated because when I put all this stuff in originally, I thought I had it lined up and level, but uh, that's what I get for trying to level it on the top and expecting the bottom to be level. Yeah, it is what it is. We got it now though. I think it looks pretty good. No? It's pretty good. Awesome. Why did we wait so long? Wasn't high on a priority list. That's the way it goes. We were trying to get moved in out of that camper. Oh yeah, that. Yeah, that. So got that done. I don't know if we're gonna we talked about putting some some uh vinegar water on it with some steel wool to kind of darken it up a little bit. We do have to do that on some of the edges and stuff and some of the little chip outs and stuff. We'll do that with Q-tips or whatever. We gotta let it marinate first. It's got to marinate. That is true. That's code for, yeah, we'll get to it later. Well, no, because it hasn't marinated. We already tried some twice. Oh, oh, she's talking about the vinegar still wool solution yeah, has to marinate. What are you talking about? I got you, I got you. We I thought, already marinated. I, I thought you were just talking about this wood to see how, if you're going to like it or if you'd rather no, darken it up it. a little bit. I love it. Anyways, y'all, I guess that's it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Join the video. Thumbs up. If not, thumbs down. We understand our, every video is for every viewer. We're okay with that. By the way, leave us some comments. Good comments, constructive criticism, things like that. Check us out on our social media, at Living Cooper on Instagram and X. And lastly, and probably most importantly, is please subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you're notified next time we upload and check out our other videos. We got a lot more property vlog videos. We got Pops and Nana Hit the Road videos. And we got some disc golf, terrible disc golf videos. Check those out. <laughs> See you guys next time. Thanks for watching.